Hi, and welcome to Jelastic, Elastic Java Platform. In this video, we will see the options which Jelastic provides for hosting MariaDB database. When we log into Jelastic and create our environment, MariaDB is one of the database options we get. MariaDB is the brainchild of Monty Wydenius, one of the original creators of MySQL. The database is fully compatible with MySQL, yet offers multiple advancements. Jelastic then creates the environment including the database server and emails us administrative credentials to the database. Now that the environment has been created, let's see what kind of configuration options we get. We can see the server IP address, reset password, and change configuration. For example, let's change the maximum data packet size and table open cache. We can then reboot the database server right from the dashboard to get the changes to take effect. We can also see the log to verify success. Open the database user interface in the browser for further administration. As I mentioned, the administrative password was emailed to us when the environment was created. Here, we get full database management capabilities available to us. For your deployments, you will most likely be creating new user accounts for database access and databases your applications will use. The databases and accounts get immediately created. The steps to configure application connection to the database depend on the actual application. For this example, let's imagine that our application is getting the database connection information from a configuration file on the application server. We create such a file right from the dashboard. Then type the database connection parameters. For example, if our application is based on the Hibernate framework, Parameters would probably look similar to these. So let's recap. In this video, we saw how easy it was to get a new hosted environment in Jelastic Cloud and configure your own MariaDB database server in there. Try it yourself free at Jelastic.com.